In this problem, we need to find the angular velocity the man must turn so that the camera stays fixed on the car. So our first step is to actually figure out an equation for r. We are given an isosceles triangle. To figure out r, we will bisect the longer side in half, which creates two right angle triangles. Since this is an isosceles triangle, the opposite angles are equal. Now that the r length is bisected, each individual length is r over 2. We can use cosine to write an equation to find r, which is adjacent over hypotenuse. Isolating for r gives us an equation to determine its length. Now, we can take the first time derivative of our equation. We need to calculate the angular velocity when theta is equal to 30 degrees. So let's substitute that value into our equations. To find the angular velocity, we need to write an equation for the magnitude of velocity. The magnitude of velocity is given to us in the question, which is 30 meters per second. Let's plug that in, along with the other values we found. Now we can square both sides. Solving for the angular velocity gives us our answer. Thanks so much for watching, and if you have any questions, please comment below.